Well, what you see here is a stock carb. Works a lot better. And this aftermarket one here. This aftermarket one here. Well, it works. But you see that right there? These holes don't line up with the original setting. Kind of have to drill out a little hole. Made it a little slightly little bigger than I should have, but that's the smallest one that I drill bit that I had that I could drill out. But when you get this, this end right here will be smaller than than the end on this side. And if you look at this one, the linkage here is bigger on the end than it is on the inside. This is, you see the factory mark, if you can see that, that's the factory mark, markings right here of a little green mark that they put on from the factory. And this spring runs on the inside, right on the inside of that one. And as you, see, as you can see, this linkage here runs on the outside as well as this one runs on the outside. And when you get this one, some of the Coleman's that I've seen, the holes on the inside is bigger, the one on the outside is smaller, and they'll run vice versa. I don't know if that has anything to do with it, but you can tell me. But this is a tunable car. You can open it up. There's, jet, there's a jet in there you can switch out. It comes with a jet on the stage one kit. But don't see it too very well that, uh, you know, it's not quite, it's, you know, it's tunable. But the, the quality from this, to, from the original one, it's just more, on the original one, it's more beefy. A lot of the components are a lot stronger. Now, this is a sealed unit. You can't tune it. As you can see, you can't just the idle. If I go down here, you can see at the bottom of the carb right there. There's no bolt you can take out of there. It's sealed. But it runs a hell of a lot better than this for some odd reason. Maybe these are better on Coleman's. But not on a Mazimo MB100. But just for you guys out there that want to put on a stage one kit, just be aware of that. This is AVMB. Out.